going on guys? Uh, today is roll cage day. We dropped the car off a couple days ago at Bobby and Tim's to get caged. Uh, so they've been working for a couple days. So now I'm about to head down over there now that my uh, daily driver S14 is fixed up, the new fuel tank. Um, we're going to check out their progress and try to get a little filming of them doing the roll cage in the process. So let's check it out. What's up guys? So today we're working on the roll cage. We gotta get the dash back in. We're gonna paint it up. So uh, I'm wearing some crappy painting clothes as you can see. So let's get started. So first things first is we gotta get this dash back into the car. Um, with the cage it's not really gonna fit. So we gotta measure and cut slots in this area and trim some stuff underneath it. Um, shouldn't be too difficult. <laughs> Okay, so we fit the dash and pulled it out, pulled the seat out. Now it's time to prep the cage for paint. The first step is to wire brush all the welded joints. down with acetone to clean off any excess grease. Alright, so we got the car masked off uh, in sections. We're just going to do the back section right now. Um, we're going with a, a gloss dark gray for the cage. Um, so something not too crazy. Trying to keep it a little subtle. So the cage is officially done. A uh, huge shout out to Bobby and Tim. I'm gonna put their Instagrams in the description below. If you ever need fabrication work, hit them up. They do an amazing job. I'm super stoked on the way the cage came out. Everything's just tucked so well. The paint came out great too. I'm just super stoked on the whole thing. So the next steps on the build is more power. So check out the next video to see what we're doing with that. 